Hello. We were live. Can I be heard or? Oh, cool. All right. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to one of the champion knockouts in the quarterfinals. We have Homer of Steel versus Green Bulmers. Should be a good match. We have the current third place against 11th place with a difference of four minutes and eight seconds between their PBs. So anything can happen, really. Should be a good race. And I believe Bulmas is asyncing, so Homer Sue, whenever you're ready, we can get going. No, apparently, can't hear anything on the channel. But he is ready. Alright, I can hear myself on stream, so should be good now. You alright for a countdown in the call, Homer Steel? Or do you want me to do a mute chat? I think you heard me before, so I'll just do it in the call. Alright, three, two, one, go. GL, GL, two both runners. Or could I also uh, get a Discord screen share guff, if possible? Thank you. Yeah, you can start. Right. We are off. What a race this should be. Looking forward to this since I still appear on the sheet. I believe this is the one of the last, if not the last, quarter final for me to take notes. Uh, there's one more in the final, but other than that, this is the final quarter-final match of the 2023 All-Story Missions Tournament. Uh, the winner of this match will be facing Baker Man, of course, who defeated Critch just a few days ago. And I don't want to commentate his curse or anything, but... I think we would all be excited for a Homer Steel vs. Bacon Man race. I feel like that would be a race of the ages, for sure. So yeah, both runners getting bushed right there. I think both of them getting 111s, which is pretty respectable. So yeah, Homer still is playing in French, so we're going to be hearing a lot of that, I think, during this race. 
and for those who don't know, French Marge is quite something, as you will hopefully hear in the uh, Flowers by Irene cutscene. It is truly an experience. Hammer of Steel already pulling ahead with a three second lead here out of SMRT. Oh, yeah, there's not really a lot going on in these first few missions, but you will see Hammer of Steel more than likely just pull away. Just from a difference in skill. The man is kind of cracked. Even at this top level, you can just see a clear difference in gameplay. And I think Bulmers will agree with me when I say he's going to need Homer still to make a lot of mistakes if he's in for a chance. Because this guy has gotten a 120 and a 119 so far in two of, out of three of his races. Which is kind of insane. Like getting times that good in an Orisa is kind of insane. But, he did get a 127 in his first group stage match, and I think that's the kind of time Bournemouth is hoping he gets here. Yeah, with this game, anything can happen. We have seen top runners be the victims of giant upsets, myself included. But although Homer Steel is probably the favorite here, it is not set in stone. Right, both runners now moving on to office space, which is pretty much the first mission that can go very wrong very fast. Starting even before the mission actually, we got Lenny Push coming up here. Which Homer Steel actually approaches with too much speed, completely just running over Lenny. Almost getting a really good push there towards the phone booth. But yeah, I think he's just gonna go for the the old school Pile King strat. I think Homer Seal is uh I think he's gonna do the new one. So that'll be pretty exciting if he gets that. It saves about seven seconds over the one Bulbas is about to go for. Yeah, Armor of Steel doing a reset. Gonna set up this new strat here. See if he gets it. Ooh. Bit of an awkward angle. That took a few hits, but. He got it in the end. Well, Bulma's getting a pretty good Smithers here. Looks like a. Yeah, just a standard three hit there. I'm moving on to Blind Big Brother. Armistil still in the lead by about 4 seconds. Also going to see a difference in route here. Homer still doing the backwards route, which is, I think, 2 seconds faster than what Bulmas is doing. But it includes this strat right here, which is called Walking on Air. This game is really weird, in the sense that if you position your camera in such a way, it just completely deloads Homer, I think. So you can just run on the same x-axis and just walk on air. You get what it says on the tin? Pretty standard stuff. Alright, I hope you're all ready for French Marge. Les citoyens de notre ville sont concernés de la découverte de caméras de surveillance dans la majorité de nos rues. 
Nous allons donc à la mairie où le maire Quimby répond aux questions d'une foule enragée. Ces cabines sont une honte. Espionner les cabines d'essayage, les salles de bain et les vestiaires de nos femmes, c'est impardonnable. Je crois que je parle au nom de tous les habitants de Springfield quand je vous dis où sont les séquences sexy. D'autres nouvelles inexpliquées. De bizarres camions Here noirs comes. sont apparus dans toute la ville. Marge, ce camion noir nous espionne. Oh, Homer, t'es tellement sexy quand t'es parano. It's not just absolutely beautiful. Oh wait, Homer Seal has got wonky driving. Interesting. I don't think this should affect things too much, considering it is a follow mission. It's probably one of the better places to get wonky driving in the run, but still makes things just that little bit more awkward. Also, Bulma's really close to hit and run here. Homer Seal pausing twice to get that wasp, just making sure he gets it. Bulma's not even pausing, not even an issue. Straight in, gets the wasp. Easy peasy. This is a very awkward position to be in for Homer Steel. Wonky driving is never nice to control, no matter what car you're in. It does control better than others, the family sedan, with wonky driving, but... Ooh, yeah. I think that's the main concern. He's just gonna skip those for now. Bulma's also getting none of the wasps. Both runners just gonna just try and get one of the wasps in 1-7, it seems. And we've gone to Bone Storm. It's another one of those missions where even just one miss drop can lose you about three to five seconds. See, so Hammer's still getting the grocery store vending machine there, which does make things a bit harder, but catches up barely enough to not miss out on the shortcut here. Very nice. Yeah, both one is getting pretty good bone storms. There hasn't really been like any mistakes so far. Like, nothing that stands out. They've both had pretty clean Hummer ones. Yeah, Hummer still looking like he's about to get a... Like a 10.54, 10.55. Miss Bulma's looking at about 10.58, 10.59. So there's not really that much of a difference so far. I'd say Bulma's is keeping up pretty well. Let's see if they go for the wasps here. I think the front one will have collision, which will mean it's harder to get. Oh wait, Homer Seal is just skipping it, okay. Let's see what Bulmas does. Yeah, Bulmas gonna go for one of the wasps here. Alright. Gets the back wasp, very nice. Also, a good thing to note, even with a wasp advantage, Bulmas is still behind on coins. And that's just because Homer Seal, he loves hitting those random objects that give you like one coin, as well as phone booths. And I think this is proof that they just add, they add up. They really do. He's got a whole wasp worth of coins, just from random objects alone. So both one is getting very good sports car RNG there. I think they both got the first spawn. You'd love to see it.
Yeah, this part of the run is, in my opinion, one of the most awkward. Like the whole 2 1 and 2 2 sequence. Especially with how tight you have to cut some of the corners here. Especially at the end of 2 1. Turning around to talk to Kelly there is kind of awkward. But of course, at this level, these ones just do an excellent job of making it look so easy. Yeah, it looks like a yeah six second lead out of Hammer One for Hammer Steel, which is not bad. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, let's go. Is this your plan to watch the game today? Uh, yeah, I have to. Watch we got some ads on Hammer Steel side. like someone forgot to time them off. Which, you know, it happens. That reminds me, actually, I need to do that before my next race. Hey, Alright, there we go. We are back to Shah, unfortunately. No more men in bushes with screens. Yeah, both one is getting a clean escape from Wigan there, very nice. So I'm still getting that wasp, no problem. Doesn't even need to pause for it. Well, Bulma's with a car in the way, but still manages to get the wasp. I'm gonna slow down a little bit, let the nerd car pass. Just a smart choice. It's more than likely if you just try and go there, it will just spin you out and you will lose a lot of time. So, very nice as well, hospital wasp. Very clean. Pretty good sports car RNG as well there for Hammer Steel. I think Bulma's just missed the Hospital Wasp as well, which will put him even further behind on coins. No problemo. He's gonna wait a little bit here. Alright, he gets pretty good RNG. Yeah, he missed the Wasp. Unfortunate. I think I should be going on comms now. I believe I could be here now on screen. I hope so. <laughs> the boys is gonna sound like I've talked for myself. I mean, I have that, my uh, audio level is like actually showing, so should be. Yeah, it should be good. Yeah, I've been <laughs> just just to give you how quick I like set up this restream. I ended up like waking up like not even an hour ago, and then I saw that like there was oh, wow. no restream for this. I'm like, uh, you know, why not? I'll just I'll just set this up real quick. You love to see it. Yeah, thank you for taking the time to retrieve this. It was looking kind of dire. Yeah, no problem. Also, oh no, Homer's still getting hit and run here, which isn't great. He's gonna need to hope for a highway spawn here, just completely out of the way. Which I think he got. Yeah. Alright, it's good. Oops. So yeah, both runners with pretty clean button franks. They both got dirt jump. Both got the car wash wasp. I really wish that went wrong.
about doing a sick backflip there. As Homer still moves on to better than beef. The bomb is following up. Let's see, what's their coin difference? That's 658 for one there. Homer still about 6 out here. Pretty similar points. Yeah, I think it's what, like a 12 point difference there. Obviously, Homer obviously hit a lot more stuff just to like, get that extra points. Yeah. I think they've both missed one wasp so far, so he's hit about 10 coins worth of objects more than Bulmas has. Not the fastest back of train collection from Homer's Hill, unfortunately losing all of his speed from being a wall I also saw Homer's have to get that uh, crossy glass at the DMV. Oh yeah. Oh! This is... Oh, he's, he's completely missing that cycle. Yeah, he's just gonna... Try and cut through here now. You hate to see that. At least, at least we didn't see him get like stuck inside the train and blow up the car. Oh yeah. We've, we've seen that happen too many times over the years. Yeah, getting that crossy glass like Bulmas did makes it so you can cut through the train easier. But I think you got a little bit too eager. Drove a little too far to the left. So both one is getting fast escape at least. Yeah, getting at the end of the mission isn't too bad. But having 700 coins here, with skipping a wasp in Homer 1 and not getting gazebo, it's kind of insane. Oh, I think Holmes just got a car bomb. Oh, uh, the cross the bagel one? Yeah, because he just ran about that time. Oh, yeah, his hand one is pretty high as well. Yeah, it's pretty rare that that happens, but... It's a free 10 coins. Just that good. Oh! Oh, oh no. I'm gonna steal. Not getting on top of the construction there. He, he missed that monkey, anyways. Wait, you can see his frame rate. He usually plays on. Oh, he's playing on 180 apparently for this race. Oh, no, I just want to go up to like almost 200. His FPS is all over the place. Yeah, it's kind of inconsistent. Yeah, Bulma's getting on top of the construction blocks. Let's try that. It does miss the monkey though. Get the reverse for that. Yeah, he'll save a little bit of time on Homer Seal there. Actually, do we know if it's uh, other races where like 200? I think they were. Okay. Yeah, it's hovering at about 196, 198. Yeah, because I think uh, when I was checking this, uh, FPS earlier was kind of stuck around 180, so I just put it as that. Yeah, I think he, he normally just runs on 200. Oh, no. oh! <laughs> that that is unfortunate. He was like a couple frames away from just ending the mission there as well. Yeah, that, that sucks. Okay, I think I think I did see his FPS like peak at around 200. So it's just whatever whatever he's doing. It's probably just uh, might just be because of him streaming and whatnot that might affect his FPS. Yeah, for sure. 
So Armor Steel is about 20 seconds ahead right now, going into sellouts. But this mission is very difficult. So things could change here. Not if he's getting second cars like that though, wow. Very nice. Beauty. I'd argue that traffic car actually helped him out there. Because otherwise he'd have a pretty awkward time with this fourth car. So Bulma's having a really rough time trying to unblock the second car. Oh, this fourth car. Ooh, yeah, this is... That ain't good. I guess he kind of does, yeah. went a little bit too far ahead. Uh, that one part. Yeah. Getting a 629 by the fire truck there. Oh, Bulma's missing that last hit on the fourth car. I think that's just a couple seconds slower than the oh, <laughs> See if he gets the cutscene skip. Oh, oh no. That's a 2306 with a missed cutscene, so that's a 2401 going into Lisa, however, Seal. Let's see if, if Bulma gets it. If he gets the lead. Oh, he gets it! He gets it. Bulma's in the lead now. By about 30 seconds. This is exciting. This is huge for Bulmas. This could just be what he needs. But as we all know, Homer of Steel is absolutely correct, so he will probably just make up a lot of that time back over the course of the run. Yeah, 32 second difference on the loading screen there. Almost also with a little bit of a coin advantage because of the Boston monkeys from Home of Steel. So I wasn't paying attention. Did we almost get the fast cycle there? Uh, I, I didn't, I didn't pay attention either because I was, I was too busy messing with some long time stuff. I think he did. Yeah, try, trying to like commentate and manage to restream at the same time is a little challenging. Oh yeah, I can imagine. I struggle to just <laughs> keep track of both of them. I mean, I'm not even doing anything else. So I hope we're still easily making the fast cycle there. Not even close. I wonder what Bulmas is thinking right now, watching this unfold with a 30 second lead in Lisa. Yeah, Bulmas will just... What? What is going on? <laughs> All right, look away, children. Some interesting car placements there. How, oh. to, how, to, how to get banned off of Twitch. <laughs> the Speed Simpsons banned speedrun. Was your hammer seal gonna go for the hit and run beach strip? Ooh, miscalculates though, wait. Huh? That works? Well, clearly I know nothing about this game. I don't know if he normally gets hit and run there, but... <laughs> I mean, it works. He got the box. Oh, Bulmers. Oh no. Okay. Oh, 
lost a lot of time trying to respawn Millhouse since he dove off the cliff. So wow, that's crazy. Homer Steel is now only 10 seconds behind. He's made up 20 seconds in the first two missions of Lisa. I, I, I honestly wouldn't be surprised if, like, Homer uh, took back the lead by the end of this level. Oh yeah, for sure. Oh, but this Oh no, I mean, oh, he's gonna keep turning. Oh, this is bad. Can you keep him in there? What, what even is this? This, this is just cruel. This is a char traffic moment for sure. That was certainly a bonfire of all time. Indeed. I'm kind of impressed he managed to keep him in there though. Side to sideways bonfire is very awkward, but it, it works, I guess. Yeah. It's pretty slow, but it does the job. Yeah, Bulmas is almost 30 seconds ahead again. That lost him almost 20 seconds. Oh, we just remember this was okay. Yeah. Ooh, this first car, though. He's just absolutely stuck in the tree. So I wonder if Homer Steel's gonna do the three wasp route here. I noticed he got the sports car there, so he would have spawned the other Camp Krusty wasp. Yeah, we've seen some absolutely amazing traffic on Homer Steel's side so far in this Lisa. I'm trying to remember, I believe, uh, is the three wasp route, is it the one in Camp Krusty, the lighthouse wasp, and then the boat wasp? Yeah. No, no. So what you do is you spawn both of the Camp Krusty wasps, and then you get lighthouse, and then you spawn either zero or two wasps so that the boat wasp has collision. I, I would assume you would try and spawn that one wasp in fishy deals on like the very end of the other side of the boat. Yeah, the front of boat and then the dam. Or you can avoid both. It's just up to preference, really. Oh, this second car. Uh, I don't know about that. Okay. <laughs> that was a very ballsy move. Oh, but, but that, that jump, though. <laughs> yeah, I don't think he was too confident, so he slowed down a bit, which cost him that jump there. I, I thought for a second that that one wasn't going to work either. Yeah, he had to like, almost hit the sign there to make that. Oh! Dude, that bin was just tanking the ground pounds. Bomber's <laughs> in that corner, so he's going to have to rely on just a pure OMG here. Yeah, he's slowing down here. To get the bar as low as possible. It's a good drop though. Just, he's gonna wanna hurry up though, because Snake drives pretty fast down that hill. Yeah, he got it. Price is averted. Um, I honestly thought that Vendor was gonna be uh, a fiver. Oh, yeah. I've noticed he does that, like, every time. Which I don't really agree with, but. It works sometimes. I've seen it not work before, though. Oh! Uh... <laughs> Alright, Snake. Just doing some sick tricks on the way down. Now that is what you call a minute. So that bonus didn't get the, uh, lighthouse wasp. I, I wouldn't be surprised if he didn't do the new route. 
Yeah, he doesn't. He didn't spawn near the wasp. He's just gonna get the bow wasp. Let's see what Hammer Seal does. He gets the lighthouse wasp. Okay. Now, if I remember correctly, he prefers not spawning either of the wasps as as opposed to spawning both of them. So yeah, he didn't spawn the front of boat there. So he might avoid spawning the damn wasp. You guff, but this is one of my favorite missions in the world. Oh, fish deals. Yeah. Okay. I'd say it's alright. It's just, just a nice, simple drive and collect mission. But you use the Malibu. I love the Malibu. Oh! Alright. Almost did very well to save that. Because that limo was driving very far to the right there. And usually it makes it a lot harder. But he gets it. Oh! Yeah, we're still posing a little early there. Opening the options menu. And that's a miss bow jump. Oopsie. He hates you. I wasn't quite sure about that angle. Oh! Lisa getting forced away there. Also, this this is <laughs> this is getting sad. Oh, Hummer's still also missing it. <laughs> we have some double boat jump missing action. Alright, that works out surely. Yeah, okay. And just like that, it's about even. Bulma's missing the wasp as well. Oh, I want to miss the wasp anyways. I think, did he spawn the dam? I actually forgot to pay attention to that. Yeah, what was that? That was a 34-24 from Homer Steel. I didn't see what bombs got. I think it's around the same time now. I'm not gonna believe this. They are they are literally tied out of Lisa. No way. <laughs> That's awesome. 34, 23 for both of them. Nice. All right, we're gonna see a big difference in routes here. Bulma's gonna do the standard uh, late in May route. Uh, what the? Oh, Homer Seal's taking advantage of this though, he's getting these he's, coins. He's, he's stuck on like a garbage truck, what is going on? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Alright. Great video game. <laughs> he doesn't know what to do. He can't get in the car, because then it'll... It'll give him the Ford Focus for the strat. He's actually just gonna have to sit here and wait. That's literally his only option right now. That is unreal. I've never seen that happen. <laughs> wow. Any day now. What a video game. Game really seems to be on Bulma's side right now. That Irish luck coming in. I uh, say that and that happens. Maybe I should just stop talking. <laughs> oh yeah, as I was saying, the difference in routes here. Homer Steel is gonna get back in the canyon area here and get inmate after 4 1. Whereas Bulmers will get it after this mission. Uh, optimally, the route Homer Steel is doing is 2 seconds, 3 seconds faster. 
it's all about preference, really. The difference is basically nothing. Yeah, I know Hammer Seal does not like the late in my route at all. Uh, with the breath that Hammer is doing, does he normally for that, uh, mission, naming your warp after for one? Uh, yes. Okay. Cause yeah, because like, he got. Yeah, because he got both of those wasps. Uh, or got that uh, gas station one while waiting, so I figured he would have had to warp anyways. Yeah. He got both of their neighbors' wasps anyway. Like the little bounce that you do on the back of neighbors. Um, that was a kind of bad second trial. <laughs> yeah, that was nasty. Bulma's not even paying attention to his hit and run me either. He's just gonna keep running over stuff. This could come back to bite him. Getting hit and run at the end of this mission can be very bad. So wow, that last drop. Pop car giving Bulma's a little love tap there. Before the mission ends. So yeah, Hammer's still picking up Malibu here. Does he have- he has wonky now, but... He has wonky driving again. <laughs> Dude. What is happening to Homer of Steel's game right now? He's had wonky driving twice, and then... 4-1 happened. Bonfire happened. What else? Just a lot of weird stuff. Happening. To be fair, it's, it's better to get it like during here than instead of like using it in uh, uh, wolves throughout the entire yeah, mission. Yeah, Because I've had to do that before and it's, it's not pleasant at all. I don't recall ever having it in wolves, but yeah, it's like a. You drive around for like three minutes, that so doesn't sound very fun. <laughs> yeah, at least in both cases so far, he's had it during follow missions. Which I'd argue is the best type of mission to get it on. Yeah, yeah this is some horrid, horrid luck from Rasil. But he's he's keeping up pretty well, considering everything that's happened. It's like Bulma was wanting to do the little boost, but it was going way too fast to do it anyways. Nah, I think that's just like, that's the thing that most people do now. They go in like that and then they turn around. Uh, instead of just like doing like the break up on the exit and turn left, whatever. Yeah. So yeah, with the route Hammer Seal is doing, you actually skip chessboard. Oh, you missed the boost off the edge. Yeah, so he'll just do what Bulmus did but as a backup instead. Nice garbage truck. Oh, Bulmus actually oh. losing 10 coins there. Oh, because it was, it was a one hit that uh, turned through seven. <laughs> yeah. Flashbacks to that three seven. You see, Hammersill will have a giant coin advantage here, I think, since he got both the, uh, the quick amount loss and the station. Although he's only 30 coins ahead, actually. Okay. Alright, we're about to see Canyonera Bushtret. I hope you're excited. One of the worst strats in the run, in my opinion. Gets it with no issue whatsoever, though. Wow. That was clean. Uh, 
Okay. That looked a bit awkward from Bulma saying it. Got the wasp. So Hammer Steel will start this mission in Canyon Arrow and it will pick up Malibu either at this phone booth here or at the bookstore. Yeah, I'll just get it here. That is... Oh, that is perfect time to get an ad. <laughs> he might get fail glitched. Yeah, because at that first drop, I'm missing it. I don't, I don't know if that will... The first know. drop is fine, he can pick that up, but the second drop drops behind him. Mm. So... And you already fall pretty far behind from picking up the Malibu there. So we could be seeing the start of the mission when we regain vision of Hammer Steel's stream. But at least we get to see some ice cream. Can you tell I'm an American? <laughs> Sorry, milkshake. And ice cream. And apple products with faces. We are not sponsored. Not yet, anyway. What if we just go back to like a two cycle? Okay, no, we didn't. <laughs> yeah, he got fail glitched. Or, wait, no? No, that's. Wait, oh, wait did he? Oh, wait. No. I thought that was... okay, never mind. <laughs> I thought that was him triggering the, uh, the sedan for the first time again. No, well, there's just not many cutscene audio. Oh, there is audio, it's just very quiet. Do we want to listen to French Marge? Just quickly switch the audio for the cutscene. Let's go. Bon sang pour la dernière fois. Parle-moi des cercles dans les blés. J'étais là, entouré de Tojo et de ses hommes de main, quand l'un d'eux, un raton laveur... I don't know what you're talking about, this is beautiful. J'ai jamais raisonné avec un raton laveur, alors j'ai... Grand-père, qu'est-ce que ça a à voir avec le cercle Pas du tout, où j'en étais Ah oui, la première fois que je suis monté dans une voiture en plus... D'accord, d'accord, ça remonte tellement loin que je dois raconter ça en couleur sépia. Nathan, what do you think is worse, French Marge or Spanish Marge? Ooh. They're both similar, like very similar, but I think French Marge is more iconic. Yeah, I think. I've only heard Spanish Marge once though, and I was pretty taken aback. Bulmers with about 850 coins buying police there. Hammer Seal does have 920, but you gotta keep in mind he already has the uh, gas station stuff. So he's roughly at around the same coin count as Bulmers. If he, if he somehow doesn't get like a gold split uh, from this, uh, wouldn't that be surprising? <laughs> oh yeah, because that'd save a few seconds. Messes up the walking on air there, and also, yeah. About that best segment. I spoke too soon. Well, that wasp actually followed Bulmas over. Having a little trouble getting it, but he does get it. At least behind some of the coins, because they're pretty far out of the way. 
Yeah, having 600 in this mission is very good. He's in a good spot. See, I didn't realize Bulmus also had the Quicken Bell Wasp. So yeah, he's about 60 coins up, but Bulmus cannot go for the uh, Chessboard Wasp in this mission, as Hammer still can. That was very sketchy, but Bulmus does get a pulse for it. How's that like? Five hits? Not terrible. I'm still also getting pulse threat. Very clean though. Three hits. Much faster destruction. That was absolutely textbook. Yeah, it was, <laughs> that split was indeed not the best segment. Yeah. Also, Homer Steel is two seconds ahead of Bulma's currently. I just compared the times going onto the bridge. Oh wow, very nice from Bulma's there. Destroying the color truck with 146 left. Homer Steel destroying it with 148. Saving another two seconds there on Bulmus. It's actually insane how close this is right now. Like, we're at the end of March and these runners are practically tied. That's a very good last trick on Bulmus. Wow, okay. What? <laughs> Alright. Homer is still. Alright, man. Don't even, Jesus. Need, don't even need the tree for that one. What a cola trucks. Like that. That is an insane cola trucks run. Yeah, Bulma's leaving Marge with about 770 coins, which is very, very good. Homer Steel leaving with about 740-ish. Was that a 4946 for Bulma's? 4940 for Homer Also, I had Homer Steel's stream open there. That was a 231 Cola Trucks. That was almost a 2.30 as well. How does he do it? I think he went into Cobble Trucks being like 5 seconds behind and came out like 6 seconds ahead. Ooh! Almost getting wedged between the platform and the construction there. Well, Hammer Seal gets that construction box. Very, very clean. Not an issue at all. Oh boy. We got liquid Wi Fi with the rate of 418. Let's go. That is quite the raid. Look at, look at all those smiley faces. We're just having a good time. You've joined in a pretty good race. The runners are currently six seconds apart after Marge. Oh, Homer uh, missed that box, unfortunately. Yeah, I, and... Oh, he's going the long way. Yeah, I don't know why he decided to try and get the box there. That's usually what happens when you go for that box in this mission. But, uh, yeah, he'll lose 15 seconds for it. Bulma's more than likely in the lead now. What a drop though, Jesus. Bulma's fall 
a little bit far back there. Should be fine. According to Tiki, you're supposed to do some sort of lockback for that box. So Amber Seal, we're gonna get ESS here, as well as Bulmers. Oh, Bulmers! Bulmers, this is bad. What are you doing? Bulmers, no. I, I think the Cola Truck uh, got that Wasp for, for Bulmers. Oh, did it? Yeah. I, I heard the uh, Wasp destruction noise. Oh, nice. And he somehow didn't fail, even though the drop was way behind him there. I mean, fair enough. Oh, we're missing the box there, he's just not gonna, not gonna opt to get it. Yeah, it's unfortunate. I think Hammer Seal checking if he spawned the Town Hall Wasp there. I think he did. Because he drove pretty close to it. Uh, okay. That was a scary 10th drop. Yeah, almost with a slightly better drop there. Oh yeah, Homer is early American. Or, not late American. <laughs> I'm surprised he's getting both. He got both construction and early American. But like, his coins weren't really that bad. I don't think he needed that, but... At least it means he can skip more stuff in 5-5. Oh wait, apparently he didn't need it. Oh right, yeah, because he missed the box. Of course. Yeah, Bulma's just getting that box there. I'm not even trying to get the wasp. 560 coins. Buying Kaba Climber is pretty good. Not too shabby. Also, yeah, Hoz really needs this wasp. Yeah, unfortunately, I don't think it has a free room. Bulmer's now moving on to Baby Van. Both one is actually doing the new route here, so they will be doing the NG Plus strat. A route that was recently found to be a lot better, actually by Homer Seal. I'm pretty sure he's the one who theorized this. Yeah, Bulmer's getting a good Baby Van here. Let's just hope the game doesn't crash. I don't think we've seen any so far from Baby Van. Not that I'm aware of. Not on Speed Simpsons, but it has happened to a couple of runners in their own runs. Ah, ooh. I'm still missing it. That. Oh, but he has this. I don't know about that angle, that might try and get out. Okay, never mind, it looks pretty stuck. That's a very good backup. Very nice. Was pausing for that wasp. With the new route, that hospital wasp is actually quite a nuisance. If you don't pause for it, it will almost definitely fly out of your reach. Mm. Yeah, I, I think it kind of noticed it starting to fly off when you paused it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, okay. So the hammer still tried it without pausing there and missed it. Yeah, things are looking pretty good for Bulmers right now. I wonder if he's gonna go for highway push here. I think he is. Oh, I know, never mind. He's gonna try and get that van, but doesn't quite get it. This gives Homer still a chance to make up quite a bit of time. Because you can save about 10 seconds if you get a good highway push. Oh, we actually missed that wasp too. Okay. In 5-1. No. Oh, oh, in 5-1, okay. Yeah, usually you just spawn the left side, but... Since you already have that wasp. Ooh! 
Oh, that trafficker. Yeah, dude. Alright, wait. Nah. Yeah, no, it's not gonna work. He needs to push him into the right two lanes for it to work. But he's gonna lose time for that. Very unfortunate. Armor Seal just not having the best of runs right now. There's just a lot of things that have been accumulating over the run. Last time I left this store, two drums put pornography in the vital magazine. Because he has, he's, he's had a couple of good things, like, uh, what, 4 7. That was really good. Oh, but yeah. The, but on the other hand, you have stuff like the beginning of 4 1. Dude, that was so dumb. <laughs> I've, I've genuinely never seen something like that happen. Especially with that route as well, because, like, you leave the canyon arrow behind, so it's not like you can just push it out of the way. Yeah, that was truly a shy moment. You will get a very nice turn around there, though. Very clean. Uh, interesting third draw. So yeah, Bulma's already at almost 300 coins here, he can skip most of this if he wants to. Which yeah, looks like he's at least skipping the wasps, so he might still get the box. Yeah. Still is gonna need more coins here. So, wow, nice Quimby truck. Well, Bulma's getting stuck on the vent there. Just gonna reset his car. Minor time loss. Why am I ahead, bruh? Says Bulmas. <laughs> Things have happened in Hammer Seal's run. To put it simply. I wish I could like judge like how good these routes are, but like I run at 60, so my coin route is gonna be like wildly different. <laughs> yeah. So it's, it's kind of hard to judge. Almost has good coins. And hammer seals aren't bad either. They're both pretty good. They won't need anything like extra, at least. Bulma's finishing the mission at 1 flat 31. So yeah, he's still ahead here, going into armor truck. Now, these last two missions... We've seen a lot of races change here. I think, uh, I think uh, some people in the past used to call it the uh, Bermuda Triangle. I think it was originally called the Triangle of Doom back in like 2020. Yeah, anything triangle related. Since you get armor truck, curate and a cutscene. Three very, very dominant run killers. Let's see how this goes for bonus. That's gonna get stuck. I can tell you right now. That is getting stuck under the stairs. Also misses the wasp. And it's flying across the whole world, alright. He's taking a trip. 
Wait, is it not stuck? There's no way it's not stuck. Wow, okay. Right, that's good for Homer Steel, though. So both getting good armor trucks. Yeah, I'm still getting the wasp there. It's gonna pick up a few extra coins before driving back to the DMV. I'm in shock that it didn't get stuck for bombers there. Yeah, Hammerseal will make up a bit of time just from killing that wasp faster and getting back to the DMV before the truck blows up. Oh, this could be bad. Oh, Bulmers. Oh my god, okay. Should be fine. That was a little close. Finishing the mission at 102.59. Homer is still finishing it. Dude, don't tell me they're still tied. Okay. Homer still is... three seconds ahead going into Curator. Dude, this is a lot closer than I thought this was gonna be. Alright. Almost getting the wasp and the box there. Very nice. Let's see how Curator goes. Yeah, that angle is just, yeah. Just let it go. Just let it go. The hammer still. Did he get the boss player? But he does get a good curator. This will put him comfortably in the lead. Let's see how Cassian's good goes. No! Get a, a bigger lead, he will. Oh my. I had to this... mute for a sec during that, and I had to just contain myself. Wow. It's insane. This puts Bulmers more than two minutes in the lead. Yeah, it's just, it looks like. Homer was just trying to do uh, one pause there, but with so with something like this, that is incredibly dangerous to do. Yeah, I don't know if he realizes how close this is or was. Yeah, expressing in chat, he's uh, really not oh. happy. What the? <laughs> <laughs> the the pole slowed him down on the jump. It's stuck, and then he reset it back all the way up here. Wow. <laughs> that is hilarious. Alright. Dude, this race is something else, man. I don't know if I can take this. So we could be on track to see a massive upset. There's only two levels left. And Homer Steel has two minutes to make up. About like about half a minute difference, not including the uh, cutscene time. Yeah, so like just under two minutes then. Th this, I know Homer still is very good at late game. Like his Homer twos and full game runs have been absolutely absurd. But I think he's gonna need something like that at this point. I just realized I should have switched the audio. Yeah, like in his PB, he gets an 808 with coins. Oh my god. It's absolutely absurd. See, yeah, Bulma's not getting 60 across the loo, just gonna grind the vetting machine across the loo and then get the motel vendor. 
I mean, yeah, if anyone can make up this time back, it is Home of Seal. The guy is wrecked. But he really does need to hold his composure here for this late game, because a lot has happened over the run, and I can imagine he's at least a little bit tilted. But yeah, this is... this is a race, alright. So yeah, if anybody doesn't know, like, the bracket, I believe the, the winner of this ends up playing, uh, Bacon Man in the semifinals. Yeah, that is correct. I, I feel like a lot of people would, uh, definitely love to see, you know, Bacon versus Homer. But oh yeah, that would be a race. Just depending on how the rest of this race goes, we might not end up seeing that. I know, yeah, it's not looking very likely right now. I mean, Bulbas is playing, playing like pretty good as well. Like I think he got a, a 103 Apu, which for Bulbas is very good, especially in our reset. Yeah, uh, Bulbas tried to do the 16 crusty move, but didn't get any bounce. Oh yeah. I just saw his coins. Dude, I'm like... I'm actually excited for what's about to happen, like... This is one of the most exciting races I've, I've seen in a while. There's been a lot going on. Bulma's collecting as many coins as he can here without well, trying not to build up his hit and remit too much and oh yes, my I, okay. I, I really questioned going in between the traffic bar. Yeah, luckily he saw that it increases hit and remit twice though. And avoided the phone booth. It's a very sketchy 6-3. Oh, and he does miss the jump there. Nice jump, friend. Oh, wow. Oh, Dude. Bro. <laughs> oh my god, what is this? Alright. He didn't, he didn't even get the thing anyways. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, Bones Bar 2 has not been the greatest so far. Just these small time losses, they just keep allowing Harmacil to catch up just that little bit per mission. And with how good he is at the game, he will just make that time back up. Bit by bit. I think Bulma's isn't careful. Bulma's now approaching Duff Truck here. That was a very wide turn, but I, I think that works. I was thinking he was gonna just clip the corner of the Duff Truck. Yeah. It's happened a lot before. Would it be worth to do like the pause on pause to get the wasp cycle for those wasps? Uh, yeah, the first one isn't too hard to get, but the second one, yeah, you definitely do need to like use the wasp cycle for it. I usually just charge into it after slowing down, but I know a lot of people like to pause instead. Either way, it works really. Almost now pushing FMJ. That was a very late push. But he does get it. 312 on the timer. That's very good. 
Just, he's, he's like just barely just getting away with these strats. Yeah. It's so borderline. Yeah, Bulma's not going to be doing the, the one cycle set to kill her, which I think is the, the smart choice. Yeah. I think there's only like five runners that actually do it anyway. Uh, is, is Homer one of them? Or... No. Yeah. He has expressed quite the dislike for the early boat route. He's not convinced that it's faster. Oh, let's go. <laughs> let's go, I was, McDonald's. I was waiting to see if you'd get the second one, then. I was just jump scared by a cheeseburger. <laughs> yeah, obviously, you wouldn't really want to risk, like, a uh, potential win by doing the, the fast row. Because I yeah. think, uh, was it Cam, I believe? I think he ended up trying to do that one of the races and. I think he ultimately lost because of that. Maybe, I don't know. But yeah, if you fail towards the end, it's devastating. Because if you make any, like, head-on collisions where you lose all of your speed, it gets real scary. Because even with perfect driving, you'll only have, like, 8-9 seconds left on the timer. Bulma's going into 6-7 here. Bart Simpson at your service. I wonder what's happening on Homer Steel's end. Dude, how many ads? Oh my god. It, it won't give me like 4 to 5 ads per break. <laughs> Oh, he is doing the one cycle, okay. I think, yeah, because he didn't get either of the wasps, I'm guessing, so... He would have wanted one of the wasps. I, I have no idea if he got that from Jay. Bulma's coming up to cutscene skip. Gets it! With a 114.36, was that? Yeah, uh, 36. Oh, I'm gonna see. This could be bad. I think if he gets busted here, he might not have enough time, and that might just put an end to the race. Okay, he at least doesn't fail the mission, but he could still lose 50 coins here. He's good. He will get crossed to Lugar. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> oh, he's just getting timed out. Oh, is he spoiling stuff? Almost told me he forgets where to go in 7-2 and drives the wrong way. Says Liquid Wi-Fi. I, I believe it. I think it's a pretty credible source. Uh, okay. Bulmers. Uh, okay. He actually did very well to not get busted there. Is he gonna fail 7 1? Jesus, that was close. Homer's still coming up the Batu cutscene. He's down a couple of points. Oh no. my god. He's missed every cutscene. For three. He's lost four minutes to cutscene skips. Um, 
Oh no, Momus. Momus, what is happening, man? How is this gonna work to not get lost? <laughs> <laughs> what is happening on my screen right now? What am I watching? What is going on? Any French alien enjoys? Alright, so Bulmers went into Homer 2 at 114.36 and Homer's seal is going in at 116.53. So Bulmers is 2 minutes and 17 seconds ahead going into Homer 2. Granted, he lost a lot of time to coins there, but essentially Bulmers needs like at least a ten and a half minute homer two for homer still to have a chance. Just a few more. Like ten thirty minimum. This is actually insane. Is now approaching 7 2 here. That looks good. Yep. Alright, nice. He's really not leaving Hummer Seal much room right now. I think, yeah. That, that's huge for Bulmans. I can't believe Liquid just lied like that. What the hell, man? What the freak? SMH, my head. Also, Bulma's finishing 7 2 at 118.45 there. Just knowing that for reference, since Bulma's lost a lot of time. The coins. But yeah, Homer Seal is really gonna need to compose himself in Homer 2 to have a chance. I can imagine he's not happy at all, but, like, it's now or never, you know, like, there's nothing else in the run that he can make time back up on. Okay, Bulma's now moving on to 7-4 as Homer still sets up 7-2. Oh no! no. Misses 7 2. Bomber's not getting an e break boost there. Disastrous things happening. Oh, that barely works. This might be over. Like, I'm not gonna say anything, because it's Homer 2, and anything can happen, but... Things are not looking good for Homer Seal. He now has to do 200 FPS 7-3. Which, as we all know, the higher the FPS, the harder this trick is. I, that doesn't look like a good lineup. Yeah, that's a bad angle. He's going to need to adjust a lot here. Oh, he's just going to try and shimmy through the cage. Get up on the right side. Wiggle, wiggle. Alright, he played that very well. Wow. And he's out. Almost now on to 7-5. Blows up the waist. He's going to have to do it again. He's mounting the cage, though. You don't have time for that right now, Bulmers. You gotta go. You're in the lead. There's no time to be wasted here. And he's out. Second try, 7 5. Yeah, I can't imagine how Homer Seal is feeling right now. 
it, it just it just all comes down to how uh, how seven six goes for gamers just to see if he'll stay in the lead. Yeah, I think if he gets this, it's it's over for him too. Alright, Homer Seal gets 7 4. First try. Clean. He has an interesting way of lining up this reset. But if it works, it works. Alright. That setup works. having some sort of like controller issue. It's something with the e-brake boost. Yeah, because the same thing happened in 7-4. Oh! Oh! Oh, the uh, alien car followed him through! What? Wait! Oh my, this could be oh, what Hermes still needs. No. This is, oh no, what do you even do in this situation? Like actually, what do you do? Oh my god. What is he happening? He, he just has to go for it. That's... Oh my god. Is he just gonna... He's, he's just gonna go inbounds. Oh no, wait. If he gets busted, he gets a wrench. He'll just lose the jump zone. Oh my... What is happening? Oh, dude, this race is too much. Yeah, he's just gonna grab the wrench. Play it safe. Doing this inbounds will lose him like another minute or so. Like another minute and a half, two minutes. Homer Steel needs to get this. I can't believe what I'm witnessing right now. It was, I think it was like earlier, I was gonna like question whether or not like if Bombers and the Async would have like played it safe if he messed up 7-6. So maybe. I guess in this sense he ended up doing it just because the alien car. But it's like it was more like he was forced to. Oh my god and, and he gets it. Homer gets it. Dude. Dude. <laughs> Holy smokes. No way he right. just clawed it back like that. Don't blow up the car here. Do not blow up the car. That's it. That's the one. And Homer Seal is ahead going into 7 7 and he's out of bounds. Nah, nah, Unless it's... he blows up the waist, this is his game. Yeah. I cannot believe the events of this Homer 2. See, does he get it? He gets the jump zone. Oh wait, did he, wait. Did he lose it? I think he went back over. I think his angle was wrong. I, I don't know. Why are you going again, bro? Just do it normally. What are you doing? I can't take this. Bro. Oh my god. He has it. He's going. Jesus Christ, man. <laughs> it's like, barring a waste blow up, I think Homer still kind of has it. Yeah. I swear to God, if he goes for the resetless end and blows up the waste that way, I'm going to lose my marbles. Almost getting hit and wrong here, alright. 
doesn't blow up the way he's tricking the alien car. Please, please just reset the car. Please just reset the car, man. Yes! There it is. And there, there it is. Homer Steel clutching out the victory. With a 126-33. I don't believe it. Insane. What a race. What a race, man. Wow. Yeah, even Homer Steel is expressing his disbelief in the chat right now. I'm sure he's not at all happy with this run. But it was just enough to clutch out the victory there. That is wild. Bulmer's finishing with a 127.52. He actually brought it back. The madman actually came back from being almost two minutes behind at the start of Homer 2. Wow. I, I mean, what a race. I... I'm at a loss for words, man. That was. I think we. I think we all are, honestly. It was so close the whole way through, and then with the missed Apu cutscene, and then the missed Batu cutscene, it was really looking like Bulma's win there. But unfortunately, that seven-six just cost him. Like the alien card just following him through there really just messed everything up. It was like, what, messing up the e-brake uh, at the beginning was, uh, that that was one thing, but then just the alien car just falling him into the shortcut of the cemetery. Yeah, just completely ruining any chance that it could set up there. Wow. That right there is one of the best races of the tournament so far. Maybe even the best race so far. Uh, oh yeah, definitely up there. That was insane. And just like that, Bulmers is out of the tournament. Homer Steel moves on to the semi-finals against Bacon Man. Also, yeah. The 4-7 gold was insane. Like a low 231. I I can't wait to see the Bacon versus Homer Steel race. That will truly be something. So champion semifinals is looking like really insane. Top four in champions now is Homer Steel, Bacon, myself, and Derek. So yeah, Homer Steel saying he doesn't really feel like speaking right now, which makes sense after everything that happened in his run. Yeah, fair. Truly really a run of all time. Forgot about the level times, but it's, it's yeah, just, just it's seeing how back and forth this was, it's just insane. Every cutscene skip from Bulmers and no cutscene skip from Homer Steel. It's tied out of Lisa, six second difference in Marge, uh, out of Marge even. Just crazy stuff, man. Wow. Yeah, I'm not. I, I don't remember exactly the last time like seen like. A run like this where somebody won the race while still missing all cutscene skips. That's four minutes lost as well. That if he got all the cutscene skips, that would have been a 122. Jesus. Well there you have it. Hammer Steel versus Bulmers, with Hammer Steel coming out on top. I think we said about everything, unless you have something extra to say, Guff. 
Yeah, it's basically it's just what a what a really good race we uh, we had. This this will be one to watch back after the tourney for sure. But yeah, that is it. The next race that's scheduled apparently is myself versus Derek, the first champion knockout semi-final. The 10th of August at 10 p.m. BST. Make sure you're all there. But yeah, I think that's about it. So we'll see you all then. Yeah, see ya. Bye-bye.